Hey guys, and welcome back to a brand new demo. Today we have the brand new Black Lion chest, which is the Vermilion Summer chest. So our new guaranteed item is the Nashbait Exotic Weapon Grab Bag, which is gonna have loads of, oh, oh. Oh, interesting. Do we have the precursors in here? Plus 32 not shown. I can't see any precursors there. But that would be very, very nice. This reminds me of the Bitterfrost Frontier black line chest. Oh, I'm an idiot. They're right at the top. <laughs> okay, that reminds me of the Bitterfrost Frontier uh, black line chest, except it's just pear pair chest rather than pair three chests which is kind of annoying because I still have two of those items from Bit of Frost Frontier anyway and uh, we also have the brand new Raptor which we're going to look at at the end after the opening and we have the new Vermilion Wings backpacking glider which hopefully we'll be able to get looks pretty cool uh, that's probably one I'll pick up with statuettes if I don't get it with so spectral weapons and the Phoenix weapons as long as the as well as the Glyph of the Timekeeper and the Reaper now we got hardwood, iron, advanced cloth, advanced leather. So yeah, let's dive into it. We have 28 keys to open today. Let's hope we get some good stuff. Here we go. Uh, shadow die kit. Okay. Another shadow die kit. That's interesting. Another die kit. This time it's the Mordra Moth. <gasps> Oh, yes. Love it. It's a very dinosaur-like uh, raptor, so I can't wait to check that out on all races. We'll do that at the end, as I said. But, oh, I am very glad I got that. What's that one? That's Krauk's die kit. Another Krauk die kit. Now we just need the backpack, really. Another shadow, yeah. Another shadow? It loads of die kits today. That is the Pajora, is it? Yeah, Pajora marches. Just regular old materials. Another Krauk die kit. Uh, Black line ticket scrap. Some more materials. Even more materials. Oh! My God. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh my God. I don't know if I should sell that or keep that. I mean, repairs are, are free nowadays, so it's not really the most expensive one, I don't think. I think the all the other ones are way more expensive, but still. Uh, contract. Oh, there's no space. Yeah, the other ones are way more pricey. Four, two, two, one, one, and then this one is the next. Yeah, four hundred. That's probably the cheapest one. But wow. Happy with that. <laughs> Let's keep going. <laughs> There's a weapon unlock. I'm still a bit like, did I actually get a super rare? Wow. <laughs> Will we get the backpack? I kind of would rather the backpack than the repair contract, to be honest. Is that bad? Uh, no backpack. But, first endless contract in, how long has it been? 2,271 days. Yeah, okay. Six, almost 7,000 hours. 
Uh, anyway, let's open up all this. I am just a bit like, well, I got that. <laughs> uh, let's do dyes first. See what we get. Ooh, we got a lot of the shadows. Uh, in rare. Is that an abyss? It was an abyss. It's probably really cheap at the moment, though. 50 gold. Not too bad. So, we got two blurple dies, which are worth six copper each. We got a phlox die, which is worth two copper. We got a peach ice die, which is worth 13 copper. We got a daffodil die, which I didn't check the price, but it's probably like 10 copper. This is the green shade for seven. Next, we have evening, which is a silver... Five silver six. We got a copper die, which is a silver forty. Now onto the pricey one, brand storm, which I do not have already, is six twenty-five. Shadow yellow. Or sorry, which I I do have already. I meant to say at uh, two twenty-two for shadow yellow. Abyss we already saw is fifty gold. Shadow Magenta is a gold 46. Shadow Violet, which I do not have already, is 2 gold 90. Shadow Turquoise, 2 gold 30. And Taro, oh, 152. Okay, we'll just sell that. <laughs> I might save the shadows to sell them in the next chest once the shadow prices go up again. Let's consume all of these uh, toy mini eggs. We got a mini jungle stalker, which miniature already unlocked. Two silver 65. We got a mini ice elemental, which we do not have already. It's 71 silver. Not bad. We have a mini whispers creator. One silver 50. Uh, a mini wolfborn shaman. 67 silver. And finally, Mini Aetherblade Elementalist, which is two silver seven. Let's get our materials. Here's our materials this time. Keep the uh, Eltrite. And that's everything else that we got. And what else do we have? We have the Guaranteed Weapon Unlock, which we get Seer's War Staff. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> there it is. I guess I can just sell my spare Seer's War Staff then. And uh, we have two Black Line ticket scraps. I do need to look at the new Black Line items. I don't know if my tickets are on this character. I don't think they are. But we have 28 exotic weapon grab bags, which can give precursors. Will I get my first precursor, as well as my first endless contract? Ebon Blade. Rune Maker. A random one. <laughs> Flame Belcher. Tribal Shortbow. Etch Bulwark. The briny deep. Edge bulwark accuracy carrion. Uh, dragon spine. And other basic ones. Basic ones. The beacon of the true legions. Short bow of rage combustion. The pearl ones. You got tin whale. Regular old pistol. Legionnaire axe. Nothing really amazing there, but there are all the exotics that I got. And a few, like, Sigil of Force is pretty good. Probably got a few good Sigils there. I've never seen this one, I don't think, have I? Oh, yeah, I've seen that. But that is quite a nice one. Right, well, that is... The oh, we have the new 
Tryhorn Raptor as well. I do want to quickly have a look at if I can. Okay, let's quickly have a look at the new. Where did I put that? I literally just. Did I not just. What? There it is. Oh, Eternal Forged Weapons. These sound cool. Let's have a look at them. Ooh. Not bad. Prefer the longbow to the shortbow. The dagger's very schnazzy. I presume it's the outside. Oh, I would have had the dagger the other way around. But that's okay. Focus. Greatsword's very nice. Hammer's very nice. Mace is quite nice too. Pistol. Quite nice. Probably not my favourite pistol though. I like that rifle though. It's quite a nice set. Definitely do some uh, Flame Legion cosplay with this set. How do you hold that sword? That's cool. very basic torch actually and then finally the warhorn there we are right let's get going with the new raptor next I'm, I'm, st I'm a bit bummed that we didn't get the the cape I want or not the cape but the backpack I wanted the backpack rather than the uh, repair contract but it's okay maybe get the repair contract years ago before he, it was free to repair things but let's use this lovely new mount. Throw on the default dies first. Here we go. Quite like it. As I said, very much like a, a kind of a dinosaur y vibe off it. Pretty cool. Does it have an idol, I wonder? No, just the regular idol. Okay. Interesting. It does look very, very nice, though. I do like the look of it. Let's have a, a, a glance at the dyes. It kind of scoots down when it runs as well, which is weird. Actually, is there an A? Regular engage skill. A unique kind of uh, mount up, mount down. A bit of a, a redness around it. Let's have a quick look at the dives. Even looks cool, just pure Shadow Abyss. But top left is going to be the main body. Top right is going to be all the horns. And the tips of the, the head there. Bottom left is going to be the underbelly. And bottom right is going to be accents on the head. It looks like the saddle as well. All in all, a very cool mount. I really like it. Let's go see what it looks like on other characters before we wrap up the video. Ah, getting sniped. Nope. Ah, get cover. Oh no, there's more Dominion down here. Crap. <laughs> Here we are on a human. Just a quick glance just to show the kind of proportions.
portion of the mount to the characters. It's quite a... It's... I don't know, is the raptor normally this low down? I feel it's a very kind of a... a, a meaty raptor. It is good. I like it. Here we are on a Silvari. Ah, let me up. Very nice again. Hey, stop that, Ascalon. All right, let's check out the next race. Here we are on a char. It looks tiny on char. <laughs> I've just been saying how it looks like really meaty and like beefy on the other races and chars. Like, oh yeah, it looks like a little small lad. Looks like a baby. <laughs> I suppose that's the way with Char, isn't it? Very good, though. And now we just have Norn. So let's go check it out on Norn. Oh, he does have a bit of an idol. Why did you never do that earlier, mister? That's the default, though, as well. So, anyway, here we are on Norn. Uh, again, yeah, it's just a decent uh, raptor. Doesn't look quite as big again, but I think it looked smaller on Char. Anyway, let's head back to Quando and wrap up the video. Right, well that is it for this week's demo, guys. Unfortunately, we didn't get the Vermilion uh, cape, or backpack, I should say. I keep saying cape. Out of the black line chest. But we will try again with the next one. I'd say it'll be in the next chest as well before it comes off and goes into the statuettes in a few months. Um, yeah, I didn't expect to get an endless contract, I must say. So I'm happy with that. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Check out this week's giveaway to be in with a chance to win the Raptor or five Black Lion chess keys. The link for that should be in the top right hand corner. And yeah, you can check out the cutscene from Drumic Rising and the full playthrough as well on the channel. Thanks, mister. <laughs> And uh, I think that's about it for me for today. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more in the future, and you can check out the Discord to stay up to date with all things new on the channel, such as new videos, when I go live, and our weekly screenshot challenge every Saturday in Guild Wars 2. That's it for me for today, but until next time, take care.